communications with resistance forces in the area have gone dark, which can only mean one thing. These people sacrificed everything to give us this shot. We need to recover that converter at all costs. on the device, but it looks like it may have been damaged during the fight. Energy readings are going crazy. I'm getting to the power of time before it explodes. Shen's working on a way to stabilize that thing, provided we can get close enough to access its core. Stay in the shadows until we can get a better read on the situation.
The Advent officers seem more capable than the grunts. We're not sure whether to chalk it up to training or stricter mind control. Commander, we have a chance to do some serious damage here. Before jumping into combat, let's make sure we make the most of our advantage. into that thing's safety protocols and stabilize it. Shen is uploading the fix right now. make up the bulk of the advent forces we've dealt with. They're disciplined and well equipped, but their obedience makes them predictable.
Avengers are uniquely equipped for close quarters combat. In the right situation, they can prove highly effective. out of time here. If we don't stabilize the converter soon, I don't think anybody's going home today. Returning to normal. Well, mostly normal. Firebrand is en route, but I wouldn't take any chances. Eliminate all remaining hostiles in the area before evac. <laughs> Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. A few of our people earned well-deserved promotions, Commander. I'm guessing Shen will probably want to have a word with you, too. Operating some of our most advanced equipment, specialists deploy robotic drones on the battlefield that can be outfitted for combat or field medic duty. Serving as our demolitions experts, the Grenadiers provide heavy ordnance delivery whenever and wherever we need it.
Just like it sounds, our sharpshooters engage enemy targets with pinpoint accuracy from extreme range. They're also trained in pistol marksmanship for the occasional close encounter. These items should prove useful in our ongoing efforts against the aliens. When you have a moment, Commander, I have made some interesting discoveries as they relate to the implant we removed from you earlier. Standing around. It's perfect. Come on, let's get it inside. Okay. I can't promise any miracles, Commander, but I should be able to put some of the stuff together in no time at all. I'd suggest we get started with a med kit. It'll probably come in handy sooner rather than later. I'm on it, Commander. Looks like Tygen has made progress on his research. We should meet him in the lab. Much of my own research based upon this simple design. If only I had known. Ah, Commander, excellent timing. There's been some progress. I've managed to break down several key components of the chip implanted into your skull. My analysis reveals that its primary function was that of a conduit, passing a vast amount of data directly to your cerebral cortex. With the primary connection severed, much of that data is lost. Several fragments do remain, however. Uh, ghosts, if you will. Observe. Tactical combat simulations. War games. The sheer volume of encounters you were processing was astounding. It... It is truly remarkable that you survived as long as you did. Though this may seem disconcerting, there is still some good news. This chip bears a striking resemblance to a medical implant I briefly assisted in developing at the Gene Therapy Clinic in New Providence. My understanding was that the implants were intended for high-ranking Advent officers only, captains or above. Retrieving a chip from such an officer would be the only way to know for certain. A greater understanding of these implants would undoubtedly benefit us all, Commander. Objective added. The Advent officers have clearly been modified to allow for their subordinates to receive new orders psionically. The implanted chip is the key. The Advent officers appear to be similar, if not physically the same as the common Advent trooper in terms of power and agility. However, field reports indicate a more developed mental acuity, as the officers do provide tactical directives to the subordinate Advent forces. I do find that area of research to be among the more intriguing options available. We'll begin work immediately. I'll send word when a complete report is available. Looks like Shen got that converter up and running, Commander. We're ready for you on the bridge. <laughs> 